What is going on, guys? You know, you know, here back again with another video today. We are here with Hell's Paradise Chapter 12. Loving this series. We're about to just hop into it. We don't really need that introduction. You already know what it is. So let's dive in. When the, the uh, when dawn breaks, take the boat back, Sagiri. The burden of this mission is too great for a woman. Half of me is in an agreement with Genji. His reasoning aside, you ought to jump at, a chan at any chance to leave this place. But the other half thinks you should stay and reign in Gabimaru. To reign in Gabimaru. You believe I can? For what I, in for what I into, he's not quite the man I first saw back on the beach. And earlier, it seems as though he saved you. It may be because he knows he can he can't return without you. Or do you have? Uh, some other theory about his transformation. Gives you the sword. Stay back. In any case, having you here with us is rest, uh, is rest assuring. That's all. I... I see. You planning on keeping the watch the whole night? I don't sleep. We also might have a shift system. Hmm. And where are the other teams doing? The higher ropes plan is to start uh is starting to look full of holes. Samurai simply obey orders. Uh um please. I mean, you feeling better yet? I mean you feeling better yet? Huh? Don't give me that look. I just didn't expect that from you. The uh wound I gave you probably made the bug's venom spread faster. So just saying. Did you not say we were short on time? Yeah, well, I reconsidered. I owe you for one. I owe you for, I gosh, I owe you one for now. You helped me see clearly and find my resolve. Rushing in blind is a recipe for, for a danger. Anyhow, as an Iwagara, Iwa, gosh, I always fuck this name up. Iwagakura, uh, Iwagakura uh, squad does show up. We'll just have to fight fire with fire. I'm determined to be with my wife for a life much, much longer than an old mission. No more running from anyone or anything that threatened that. I'll meet all com uh, I'll meet all comers head on. Such strength. You're pretty strong yourself. Stronger than me, even. Th that's not no. It's true. I've got an eye for those things. Maybe it's your heart, uh, maybe it's your heart, skills, and body. Maybe it's just your nature. Whatever the case is, you were so strong back at the jail. That isn't just my impression. It's something more solid than that. It's like I felt it somehow. More than that, you didn't expect it from me. You didn't. Uh, you didn't expect from me. Yes. Well. We had a saying back at the village. One cannot know one's own strength without first journeying far away, uh, far and wide. Weirdly enough, most of us don't really know ourselves, not until we're forced to act for the same, uh, same for everyone. I'm glad they had that talk. That's a nice talk. I like the character development again. It's building a relationship. It's nice to slow down and really get these type of uh, conversations. No threat from dusk to dawn. Maybe the monsters aren't active at night. So have you prepared to leave, Sagiri? I'll guide you to the boat we came on. I appreciate your concern, but I'm not leaving. I'm not fucking leaving! I'm not leaving! It is the assignment you're worried about. Don't. No. At this point, it concerns how I live my life. All the more ridiculous. You're a woman. Uh, once you return, your role in life is to bear children for the Yamada clan. That's what I've been always told. That's what I've always been told. The strange look in their eyes full of scorn for a woman who wields a blade. As if to say, know your place, woman. That's right, break the barriers. At times, even from my father, those eyes full of disappointment. Women can't inherit the Yamada blade. Forget all those uh forget all this and live like a proper woman. Contempt from the outside world for being the daughter of the neck chopping Asa. Shunned by my peers for choosing a life of Yamada warrior. Returning now will haunt me for the rest of my days. You just don't get it. People expect you to live like a woman. It's only natural. 
There, there. It's precisely that look I cannot bear. How dare you? Please, look on me as a fellow samurai. You uppity, please. Forgive my insolence against my betters and accept, the, uh, accept that uh, this is how I've chosen to live. Let me zoom in. Okay, here we go. I acknowledge my own weakness, my lack of experience. Yet, no more running from anyone or anything that threatened that. Yet, one should be free to choose uh, one's own life. Whether man or woman, and regardless of one's station, isn't it only natural to feel that way? And look at all the characters. I love how all the characters are being shown. I beg you to understand. I can't stand to hear that. That isn't the way of the samurai. Are they going to fight? They're going to fight. Oh, <laughs> this island's a battlefield. No place for women or children. He pulls his sword out. Oh my God. I won't stand my hand next time. Hmm. Wait, what? What happened? Did she grab his blade? What? When you in battle, one must secure, uh, one, gosh, um, in battle, one must sometimes procure a new blade on the spot. I believe you taught me that lesson last night, Sir Genji. Stole his blade? Nah. Damn you. That's the jo- Oh, shit. Okay. 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 Damn you. Oh, shit. Okay. The katana is the warrior's soul. To steal it is Sir Genji. Oh, shit. Why the fuck does it end like this? I I hate- They don't even- Like, you usually see the to be continued or something, but no. It's just- Ow, ow, okay. We're hopping into chapter 13. If you want to see more, subscribe to the channel, hit that bell notification. You already know where to find me. Um, if you want to see more, wait, I already said that. Anyway, if you want to see more of me, uh, follow me on Twitter. Hey, if you know, you know. Until then, you know where to find you now.